Today in Cadet Summer Training, the cadets are here at the gas chamber where they will build trust in their equipment and learn how to monitor the environment without it. The chemical, biological, radiological, nuclear chamber training gives the cadets a chance to learn how the equipment works. Sergeant Hunter Borash has more. CBRN is an acronym, so it stands for Chemical, Biological, Radiological, Nuclear. Um, uh, basically, within that, we detect, identify, collect, and decontaminate it. And that'd be our specialties for it. Here we go through uh, wearing proper PPE for it versus elsewhere they might be doing movements or stuff like that. So this is kind of just like protection for it, decontamination of it. And with the CS chamber, you kind of, uh, I guess, kind of learn how to react to it appropriately and take proper precautions. All right, work one last time. You ready? Sure. Gas, gas, gas. Yank them strapped over. Once inside, the cadets will remove their masks. They are then forced to endure the gas. Cadet Brennan Egan explains the importance of this training. Uh, this is important because I mean, you need to know this kind of stuff, and you know, now in case of an attack, I, as a you know future soldier, I'm equipped to be able to be ready for these kinds of things, and it's definitely something that I'm happy that I have the training for, and other people aren't fortunate enough to have it. With the gas chamber training out of the way, the cadets are ready to tackle even greater heights this summer. This has been Josh Short reporting from the Public Affairs Office in Fort Knox.